tames it is. So excited. We'll see if it's the best lobster roll. Not sure yet. Oh my god, look at that butter. This is a moment of truth right here. Ruby included you in her prayers last night that it would meet your expectations. Oh, oh he's in another best world. One. It's the best one. There's not another lobster roll as good on the East Coast, even as Red's. Thanks, Oyster House. Do you remember Red's? We go. Red's? We did it. Drown it with butter, right? That's how it's good. And Owen went for the burger. Why are you adjusting the fenders? Because we've had bad night after bad night after. Why is we that? Squeaky fenderitis. Because <laughs> the fenders are here, and when the boat smashes up against the dock with the fenders in between, it goes squeak, squeak, squeak. And this little buddy. Okay, bye. We are in DC. It is so hot outside. It's it's like almost a hundred degrees. It's so hot on the boat. We can't plug in, so we can't use it. Last night we turned on the AC, but it took like half the night to cool the whole whole boat down. So we decided to just come to DC, get a hotel, and explore DC. We've never really spent a lot of time here, so we're excited to spend I think like four days here. Right? Yep. You excited? Yeah. Yeah. Can you imagine flying on this thing? They flipped a coin, the brothers flipped a coin to see who got to go first. And we were joking that uh, they flipped a coin of who had to go first. And you know, it's it's just so cool to read about their story, the Wright brothers' story of uh, passion to make flight happen and to see where it's come today is so cool. As a family, we keep talking about forward motion in all that we do and don't let little things stop us and jam us from progressing. And I think this is such a prime example of forward motion, forward motion, forward motion. And as you continue to just move forward and work through the trials and the hard things, that uh, things just open up for you. And, uh, and I, I, I'm a firm believer as we move forward, God just opens doors for us simply. Hey, look good, Are you ready for the That's perfect. <laughs> CDC. We rented, or not rented, we booked a tour that takes us around on an electric cart to see all of the, all the things. So cool. funder from Catalonia and immigrated here and had a dream of uh, building ice cream slash restaurants. And we, yeah, it's about one year ago. Yeah. That's crazy. So we we're there about a year ago. It's such a cool little island. It's in the Ionian Islands, but uh, such a cool little place. Kind of fun to make that connection. So the capital was so cool. We had such a good time. Our tour guide was awesome. 
she's so sweet to uh, to take us around. But uh, if if you're ever here, you can go um, contact your uh, state representative, and they'll take you around the Capitol. Hopefully, if they have time or whatever, and you can actually get into the uh, White House. Apparently, it's fairly easy, but you have to plan ahead. Give them your uh, they have to do a background check and stuff. So you have to do it online. That says about 30 days out. So we feel bad we didn't uh, do that. Would have been fun to be able to go in there. But anyway, the capital was incredible. Super fun. It's raining so hard. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Emerson with the fancy! Oh, we got thunder. So you got the white squirrels. There's two of them. Look how cute he is. So today we came over to the Museum of Natural History again to kind of catch a few more things that we didn't see. And then we're going to go to Mount Vernon. I forget it where else. But uh, now we're going to meet up for dinner with one of Tina's friends from uh, college. wild being here just thinking about uh, how blessed we are to have our freedoms and uh, all the wonderful people that have um, died and sacrificed their lives so that we can do what we're doing today and you can do what you're doing today and I feel uh, blessed that so many people have fought for my freedom and I hope I can always remember to do my part to fight for freedom. All right, go ahead, bud. Never looks scary when you start, but then it's like wowzers. So on top, our wind instrument, just the wind vane to with the NKE system broke off. And now I'm seeing, I'm pretty sure I can just replace the uh, wind vane. Give you a good view. Whee! There's Baltimore. Hey guys. So I just uh, um, got, oh, I can't even think what the name. There's a place here that I think we found to upgrade all of our electrical stuff and switch our gas over to electric, upgrade our uh, battery bank. Hopefully, just catamarans down in Florida will do it and they have an awesome reputation, but they're in Florida and we really can't get down there till November just because of hurricane season. So anyway, we're trying to figure out how much uh, extra insurance will be if we do choose to go down there but uh, hopefully these guys that we're gonna meet with in Annapolis tomorrow um, can take care of us we'll see there's a beautiful jellyfish there shoot it's uh, kind of tied down zip tied down but anyway carbon fiber I think it's like 1800 bucks so and this is the piece that broke off so now I need to figure out how it's attached so we can just replace the one. Looks like it's just one little screw. But it's too high, I need to get it to come down and then uh, I have to do that. Oh! We are leaving Baltimore. We had so much fun in DC. We went up to Philadelphia uh, for, uh, we went and visited one of our offices, our pest control company, but uh, it's super fun to be with all those guys this morning. 
and now tomorrow morning we are going over to Annapolis and it's like uh, 30 miles away or so. We have a guy over there that is going to hopefully convert a lot of our stuff over to electronic, uh, electrical for our stove and oven, upgrade our battery bank as well, and then a few other things. So hopefully we can do that. We may end up taking off and going down to Florida. We'll see how it all pans out, but uh, we are excited to go to Annapolis. We hear it's uh, such a cute little place, so it'll be fun to get down there. We thought we'd wake up early, but uh, it's like nine o'clock. So there's no wind, so it's, I'm gonna pivot the boat off the dock, and then there's a little channel that we'll back into and then pull right out. Our uh, first captain that was with us would always say, low speed makes small damage. Bye, Baltimore. Pulled up into Annapolis. Well, it's been a few hours. Uh, we had some guys come on the boat, uh, kind of looked through some things uh, that we're trying to get upgraded. Been washing the boat. So cool to be right here on the town dock in Annapolis. It's uh, it's always so fun. It's good for a change to be in towns like this, and uh, we look forward to exploring a bit here. Rock and roll. Three, yeehaw, guys. One, two, three. Yeehaw! Goodbye.